Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing another 250K empty pack opening of these brand new 16 bit packs. Packs are actually looking pretty solid today. A lot of good cards came out. Got a Dark Matter Lomelo, Dark Matter Christos Porzingis, both of them are top cards in the game. We got a Galaxy Opa Rudy Gay, looks really solid. Kyle Korver as well. Jonathan Isaac going to be an elite budget 3 and D wing. Michael Porter Jr. actually looks souped. They made him a lot better as well. Mark Eaton, who I had high hopes for but can't shoot, so I don't know how good this card's going to be. And then we got a few other pink diamonds the most notable of which which is certainly dino raja who looks like one of the best budget cards in the game so overall pretty solid pack drop a lot of pretty good cards hoping that we can pull ourselves a galaxy opal or two maybe even a dark matter have not pulled a dark matter yet this year so hopefully that today maybe will be that day huge shout out to my boy jen for letting me hop on his account to record this pack opening appreciate him letting me open these packs but without further ado let's hop right into it gonna go down to right around a million mt so let's see what we can pull today in this this pack opening starting off with the first pack is going to be absolutely nothing nathan knight and demar Derozan. so definitely not the greatest start in the world um i'm kind of surprised demar is only a ruby to be completely honest in this series two cards uh but second pack no shake in this one either and definitely not looking like the hottest start bam out of bio in that one so um i don't know it's going to be interesting to see today how these pack odds are looking because recently pack odds have just not been all that good uh ever since they did that stellar pack of or the, the way they did the stellar for like one set pack odds just have not been that good as we do pull our first pink diamond in the video we'll take that not going to complain at all um but i pretty much know it's not a dark matter if it doesn't have that special shake because dark matters have a different shake than the rest of the cards i think this is robert pack i mean this card looks super athletic but i don't know how good he's actually going to be considering he's six foot two so not sure how good of a pull that actually is but uh three packs one pink diamond definitely losing mt so far but all it takes is one pull and we're going to have ourselves a very very successful pack opening nothing in this pack at at all unfortunately zach levine and colin sexton um and yeah i mean i don't know I, I think i think these packs overall are actually pretty good i think we got some really good cards for budget or no money spent type players guys like jonathan isaac michael poor jr no no dark matters in this pack but we go oh, galaxy opal okay hold on this is okay that is what i like to see a galaxy opal pull let's get this amethyst out of the way real quickly a galaxy opal in our fifth pack that is not bad uh i'd take jonathan isaac i'd take michael porter jr who is the other galaxy opals my brain is now forgetting who the other galaxy opals are but uh this I mean, this pack today, this set has some pretty good Galaxy Opals, so I think this could be also Kyle Korver, who would not be the greatest pull. But, I mean, this set does have some pretty good Galaxy Opals, so maybe we'll pull one good here. And, okay, I think we pulled Rudy Gay. That is a super solid pull. Oh, no, it's Michael Poor Jr. I thought the player build was, was Rudy Gay, but either way, Michael Poor Jr. is an awesome pull. This is one of the best cards legitimately that came out today. I think he's going to be an absolute dog, an amazing value card. And I'm really excited to try out this Michael Poor Jr. because I don't expect him to be super expensive, but he looks really good. I think that's a great pull. Uh, definitely a very, very solid start to the pack of and getting, our, getting ourselves a Galaxy Opal MPJ in the fifth pack. Definitely cannot complain there as we go and get another shake, but unfortunately, this time it's only an Ameth, so definitely nothing to write home about there uh, i believe it might be donovan mitchell or i think i think it's donovan mitchell yeah okay so amethyst donovan mitchell here um and yeah so not a bad start to the pack opening a pink diamond and a ruby in the first 90 ish thousand or pink diamond and a, a galaxy opal i should say in the first 90 ish thousand mt so definitely not the worst start in the world to a pack opening but would like to pull another opal or two if we're not going to pull a dark matter to make the return on this pack opening semi-decent nothing in this pack unfortunately we do get jordan clarkson uh and let's just keep on ripping for now because i mean i i can't complain too much about the way that first 100k went i really don't think it was that bad uh second 100k hopefully will be just as good but nothing in these last couple packs a terrence ross who is now on the suns um suns are going to be an interesting team to watch for the rest of the year for sure with kd d book deandre and chris paul that's a fun lineup all right another pink diamond in this one our second pink diamond of the video just throw me a dino raja real quickly that's the type of card we all know we're looking for anyway it's not gonna be dino raja it's a western conference point guard our second pink diamond is our second raja Robert Pack, unfortunately. I would like to pull a new pink diamond. That would be nice. But a Robert Pack, I guess you can't complain. It's better than not pulling anything. So um, we will take it and we will keep it pushing. Um, we're due for another good pull, though. I mean, I, I don't know if do is the right word, but I'd like to see another one or two good pulls in this pack opening for sure. You get a Tyrese Halliburton and a Boyan Bogdanovich in that pack. Nothing too crazy there. Um, let's see. Give me a shake in this one, please. I would appreciate it. Come on, 2K. And we get two. All right. Give me an opal this time. Pink diamond. 
Amethyst. Dang it, I was hoping for another Opal. Um, when I don't see the Dark Matter shake, I'm just hoping for Galaxy Opal, man. Plain and simple. Uh, I'd like to pull a Rudy Gay. I'd like to pull a Jonathan Isaac. Uh, even Kyle Corver would be nice, but I just want to pull some new cards. Get us some cards we could do gameplays with, that type of stuff, as we do pull ourselves a Jalen Brown in this in this pack. Uh, and then we're also going to get a Pink Diamond. Who is this going to be? Give me Dino Raja. It looks like it's Anferny Simons. So, um, I don't know. We'll see how this goes, to be completely honest. But we got about 120, 130,000 MT or so left to go. Uh, and for any Simons in that pack, nothing too crazy, uh, but 1.12 mil. So we got a maximum of about 120,000 MT left to rip. Uh, just go slightly over that 250K mark. Nothing in that pack either. Damn it. Jalen Green. I'm, I'm waiting, man. We haven't gotten a very good any very good pulls in the last 100K or so of packs. Really hoping that we can clutch up here and get ourselves a really good pull or two. Nothing in this one either. Damn it, bro. These just, packs are just, they're not favor me right now malachi branham i guess i mean he's he's been a pretty young player but that's a gold card we're not looking for gold cards although the golds i guess are more expensive than some of the other ones but another pink diamond here please give me dino please that's like the one pink diamond everybody's wanting today dino and we pull ourselves another anthony simons so four pink diamonds they're all short PGs, Anthony Simons, and Robert Peck, unfortunately, to this point. So nothing too hot in that last 100K of packs at all. But we got about 100K left to go. Maybe we can finish strong and pull ourselves at least another Galaxy Opal. Okay, we got 80K. So we got five more packs to go. And hopefully these five packs we finish strong, plain and simple. Because if not, it's kind of going to be another disappointing pack opening, to be completely honest. Uh, let's just back out real quickly, see if we can take a look at the cards and packs. Test. Oh, my God. There are three KPs on the auction house and four Lamellos. Ha! Take that for what you will. I, I'm going to tell you all again. Don't open packs. It's just never worth it. It really is never worth it. You might get lucky. I mean, I know Evan's been getting lucky in his pack openings recently, but pack openings generally are not worth it. And that is why right there, packs have been out for a good eight minutes, nine minutes, and we have four Lamellos and three KPs on the auction house. So take that for what it is worth. And what it is worth is the fact that pack odds are not good, which is not news, but it is a little bit disappointing. Uh, Russell Westbrook there. I mean, that's cool. I guess the Clippers Russell Westbrook, but we got three more packs to go. Can we please at least pull another Galaxy Opal or something? Let me let me salvage this pack opening. Make it decent. Nope. Nothing in that one either. Jalen Duran. Um, two more packs. We got to finish strong. Come on, 2K. Let me get a little bit lucky, please. I need it. And uh, second Galaxy Opal. OK, there we go. Thank you. I appreciate it. That is much better. Don't be Kyle Korver. That's my one request. Por favor. I think it's Kyle Corver. Gosh dang it. I mean, I guess we'll take it, but that's not that's not the Opal you're looking for. You're looking for Rudy Gay. You're looking for Jonathan Isaac. I already pulled Michael Porter Jr., but I would have taken another one of those. Kyle Corver is just never that exciting of a card in 2K, to be completely honest, because we know what he does. He shoots the ball, but overall, that's not the greatest pull in the world. Final pack of this video. Just finish me off with one more shake. That's all I ask for. Okay. They finished me off with another shake. We pulled ourselves another pink diamond. I guess I can't complain. If it's Dino, I'd be suit. I'd be very happy about that. I don't think it's Dino, though. It is not. And it is going to be Mark Eaton, who would be awesome. This card would have been so awesome if he could shoot, but he can't shoot at all, which means him being the Yao stopper in theory is not going to be the Yao stopper in reality, unfortunately. But overall, not the worst pack opening. I mean, two Galaxy Opals isn't bad, but I would definitely have liked to pull a couple more. Uh, and I'm really... Just waiting on that dark matter pull man plain and simple these packs have just not been that favorable it does look like lamello and kp are starting to pop out of packs a little bit more which is good but hoping if you all open packs your pack openings go a little better than mine did today we pulled ourselves a good what five pink diamonds two galaxy opals nothing terrible but i wouldn't say that was the best pack opening in the world either so with that being said i hope you all did enjoy the video if you did make sure you hit that like button leave a comment and subscribe i'll be back with more 2k content very very soon and i appreciate y'all peace